hi uh, Anthony and anybody else who's watching. Um, Anthony was wanting to know how to do spiral text so here's a quick overview. Uh, start with a blank hoop and I'm going to do this in hyper font. So type the text I want you to tell me off. Um, for the font, I'm just going to go with the Arial. I know you know how to do all the fonts, so I don't need to go through that. I'll do a column stitch, although it probably doesn't matter. Finish that. Just want to get it. <coughs> excuse me, onto the screen, and I'm going to turn the hoop off just so it doesn't get in the way of showing you what we're doing. Um, for the spiral, you need to use one of, I think you can use all three of these. Hang on, that one, that one. No, it's it's this first one of the three. What you're looking for is this underline, not the box around the outside, but the underline to the words with that little handle on the end. If I zoom in a bit what you're looking for is this handle here that's on the that sort of like underlines the text for want of a better way to describe it so if I come back to here move the box up and so what you do is you get hold of this little handle and you can drag it down and I don't know if you can see this little arm here if I pull that little arm round, you can see it moves the curve of the line. And there's like a halfway point which also has these little handles on it. And the start point as well has the little handles on it. But you don't have to um, just move the points and the handles. You can actually come anywhere along the line. That will make more sense in a minute. So I'm going to drag over here. I'm going to curl it round there. I'm going to bring that center point down. But now I'm coming like in the middle of the line. And I'm just going to stretch that out a little bit. I'm going to move this one over. I'm going to pull this up. I'm going to spin it around a bit. So hopefully you can see idea of what I'm what I'm doing so you just keep tightening it up depending on how much text there is on your spiral I'll stitch it now and I don't want the multi hoop so is this what you're talking about getting your spiral um, so if it if it is come into the edit mode again you need to come to your frames and this first one um, I have to say I thought you could do it with all, all three but um, you can see how I, I did it on this instance with this one hopefully that's that's what you what you meant so ask me any questions and I'll talk to you later you take care now bye